Okay, the title may have been a slight exaggeration, but this is the best face mask that I personally have ever used. It has amazing filter technology, fits perfectly, to my face at least, and is the best looking mask that I've seen so far. This is the Oz Air Airweave Merino Mask, and yes, it's a mask made out of merino wool. That makes this mask super easy to breathe through, super comfortable to wear, but also has antibacterial technology that keeps it fresh and resists odors. Those are just the properties that merino wool and copper has, and it's a great idea for a mask now that I think about it. Inside the box, you get the mask itself, that they call the Airweave Merino Mask Skin, an antimicrobial copper carry bag, and two Airweave copper filters. Now, before you check the price and comment down below how pricey this thing is, keep in mind this unboxing experience. This basically feels like an unboxing from Apple. But spoiler alert, this thing is definitely worth the money. There are three different colors that they have to offer classic black, stone gray, and coffee cream. It also comes in three different sizes, medium, large, and extra large. And there is a sizing guide on their website just so you get the right fit. Now let's take a look at the mask itself. It looks super stylish and clean, minimalistic even. A friend of mine said that the texture of the fabric kind of reminded him of Yeezys, so they definitely give off that premium vibe. There are two rubber portions on either side of the mask with the Oz Air logo, and it's a nice accent piece, but it's actually functional. You're going to use those pieces to attach the removable, replaceable Airweave copper filters. If you take a look at the inside of the mask, you can see that the rubber portions are also indicators on which side is the left and which side is the right, just so that you don't wear it upside down. The rubber pieces don't ever get in the way, and I don't feel them when I'm wearing the mask with or without a filter on. The straps are elastic, but they are also adjustable with these rubber stops to better fit your face. They're super comfortable and elastic enough to where it'll hold the mask in place without it being too tight that it constricts. It's like the perfect balance. They're calling them adjustable cushioned ear loops, which is pretty true because they don't irritate my skin and they feel soft. They don't feel like dental floss like other masks that leave red marks on your skin after a long period of time. Once again, they're very comfortable and I can easily go the whole day wearing this mask. At the end of each strap, there are also metal end pieces which is a nice premium touch. Let's take a quick look at the carry bag. It's copper infused which makes it antimicrobial and it seems to be a bit water repellent as well. It's a fairly simple design, but a simple carry bag is the best in this case. You have a little loop on the side to attach something like a carabiner and the top just opens up. So to open it, all you do is squeeze the sides, and other than that, it just always stays closed. It's not as portable as I'd like it to be, meaning that I can't really fit it into my pocket, but you can fit it into a small bag or something similar. I usually just jam my mask into my pocket anyways, so you don't really have to carry your mask in this pouch if you don't want to. Or I don't, at least. It's recommended that you do to keep your mask as clean as possible though. You get two filters starting out, but you can get some more on their website. Each filter lasts up to 15 days, and the breathability is like no other. The filters have a mendable foam nose bridge, which allows you to adjust the mask and conform it to your nose for optimum fit. That's what they're calling their airlock seal, and that coupled with the breathability of the mask as a whole makes their anti-fog system. That basically means that you'll have a lot less problems with the dreaded glasses fog. I personally don't wear glasses, so I wasn't able to test this out, but with the filter on, there was very minimal air escaping through the top. However, if you're wearing just the mask skin without the filter, the problem is still present, but that's to be expected. This is the best fitting mask that I've ever used. With the filters on, the mask does get a little bit thicker, but it's amazing how easily you can breathe through this thing. You can read more about it on their website, but they say it's the most breathable, natural filter media on the planet, removing the finest submicron contamination with the lowest airflow resistance. That's pretty cool if you ask me. 
I wore this thing on the night of the Spider-Man No Way Home premiere. And don't worry, I'm not gonna spoil it for you. But my friends and I wore fancy suits and dresses. And what I'm trying to say is that this mask can fit into pretty much any situation. Especially if you get different colors, you can mix and match them with different outfits. It does kind of look a little clunky with a filter on. Not when you're wearing a mask though, only when you're holding it in your hands. But I did not have any trouble with wearing it all day or stuffing it down my pocket when I wanted to eat some popcorn. If I had to nitpick and tell you a downside that this thing has, it would be that sometimes the rubber portions that hold the filters can pop out or even fall off randomly so you can lose them. It only happens though if you're wearing the mask skin without a filter. But it happens especially if you're like me and sometimes shove your mask down your pocket when you're not using it and you want to put it away so you don't lose it. However, bringing it back out can rarely pop them out of the mask, but it does happen. And I don't really see anywhere on the website if you can purchase these replacement rubber pieces or not, so I guess you'd have to contact them directly if you do. So if you have to shove your mask down into your pocket like me, just make sure you have the rubber pieces on the mask every single time you take it out of your pocket. So if you have the money to spend on this mask, go for it. You don't have to have a filter on it all the time, but if you want that extra security and peace of mind, it's a nice thing to have. This is the most good looking, comfortable, and breathable mask that I've ever used, and I highly recommend investing in one or multiple. It's 100% worth it, and I'll leave a link to their website in the description as always. If you enjoyed, found this video helpful, you know what to do. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace. I gotta fix my tone. Gotta lower your tone.